Hi guys, this is Nikki Blue on TikTok and Blue Star 3 on YouTube. And I just want to show you my coffee replacement, which I've been having every morning, is a full glass of Kabuka. Cheers to Howie. Um, cheers. And um, I just want to give you guys an update on everything. This is insanely good insane um so i am waiting for my food stamps in the mail i'm praying to god i get them eventually i just finished the appeal process for my disability i don't know if that's going to go through but i really need it because um i need assistance I am going to the gym tomorrow for my second time, and I am doing good otherwise. I haven't been vlogging or blogging as much. I mean, I guess I just have to say what's obvious. I've been a little depressed lately, which is bad. But I'm praying to God that it gets better. My depression stems from having to do all this work all by myself and not a single attorney or entity in this town will help me. I realize I messed up in my past, but I think Everyone deserves a second chance, especially when they're genuine and really want to improve. You know, I've been out of prison since February, and I haven't touched a drug, done a drug. I haven't even got drunk, and I don't drink alcohol. I don't smoke cigarettes. I don't do any of that. The most that I did used to do is drink a lot of coffee, which I've replaced with Kabuka, which has no caffeine in it, by the way, but it's just, it has um, probiotics and I just love it. It's so good. But, you know, it's just, I don't know. I guess. I've been kind of like jaded lately, like, like I want to date, but I don't, which makes no sense. I guess I kind of want a Christian based relationship because the relationships in my past were full of one night stands and just sex, you know, and I'm not about that anymore. I would rather have just a Christian type relationship where um, it's personality based, faith based, you know, just like them liking me for me. And I know sex is important. But to me, I would rather have a relationship where they like me as a person versus just sex. And then they pretend to like me as a person because at the end of the day, they just want to get laid. So I guess that's what makes it different for me right now. I do got some cool news. I don't have it on me. It's in my room. I forgot and I left it in there. But... um. I got makeup now, but I do want to add in, I got the makeup at the cheapest places I could think of. Dollar Tree is where I got most of my makeup. Then I got the rest of it at Walmart. And the most expensive thing I got was the foundation. Y'all, like, to me, foundation is like purified mud. You know, it's like the color of your skin. Um, it's supposed to, like, cover up your bad spots and all that. But it is so expensive. 
And I'm a fan of Neutrogena products because I already have oily skin. As it is, I already have oily skin, as you can see. And so I like to get makeup that doesn't have a lot of oil in it. And so my most expensive thing I got was the foundation. And it was the only Neutrogena product I got. They had a bunch of Neutrogena products at Walmart, but they were all so expensive. But I decided to buy one expensive makeup product, and it was the foundation. Because to me, if I'm going to wear it for a couple of days, it's worth wearing something that's not going to break me out in 100 million pimples. But for $14, y'all, you only get like this much, like a bottle this big of foundation. I'm just like, they, they, they even shrunk it. Like, I remember before I had my accident, before I went to prison, when I was modeling before, like, the bottle was, like, this big. Well, not only did they shrink the bottle to this big, they increased the price on it by 25%. You know, it used to be, like, 9 bucks. Now it's 14 I had a little help from a friend called Howie. He helped me with the makeup purchase. But um, I'm excited, you know, because I haven't worn a face full of makeup for six years. And honestly, the first six months I've spent out of prison, I haven't worn makeup yet. So this face has not seen makeup. There was a few videos where I had a little lipstick on, but that was like it. And unfortunately, that lipstick I can't find right now. And that lipstick actually came from prison. It, I do remember, though, it was wet and wild, and I got it in prison. Never worn it, though. Like, I literally just bought it and didn't use it. So when I brought it home, it was still wrapped up in the plastic and everything. I made a cute video putting it on, but I didn't hit record so it didn't record the video, which I do that a lot, y'all. Like, you think you see all my little snippets. Honestly, half the time I don't even hit record properly and it doesn't record. And then at the end of the day, I'm like, wow, how many times did I not record myself because I thought I was recording? So, but tomorrow I'm going to the gym. And then after the gym, I'm going to use some kind of, like, I'm going to go to a bathroom somewhere, wash my face off. Or I'll probably use the bathroom and Planet Fitness. Wash my face. And then I'm going to put on some makeup and do a few videos. Um, take a couple PG pictures, y'all. Just like a couple facial pictures. And I'm going to enjoy doing it, but try really hard not to put pride in it, you know. Because that's a sin. And I'm trying not to have pride. But I am excited about putting on makeup tomorrow, especially since it's been so long. You guys are probably going to laugh at me because I haven't put on eye makeup in so long. But I have every kind of makeup except for lip liner. I forgot to get that. But I don't think I need it, and I don't really want to buy anything else. But if I do get anything, that's the only makeup piece I'm missing is lip liner. But anyways, so I feel better. I feel I feel good because I am waiting for my food stamp card. The first one they sent out got lost in the mail, so hopefully the second one won't get lost in the mail. I finished my appeal. Now it's just the wait game. And if it all fails again, I'll just have to redo everything again because I'm not going to give up. But um, that's about it, y'all. So... I'm happy I was able to give you guys an update on everything that's going on. I know I'm not posting as much, but tomorrow I should be posting a lot after the day is over with because I am putting on makeup. You guys are going to see makeup on this, usually makeupless face. So, um, yeah. I love you guys. Love God. Love Jesus. Love yourself. I love God and Jesus and myself. And have a good day, y'all. And... I'll see y'all tomorrow with makeup on. I'm excited. I hope you guys are too because I'm probably going to look a lot different than I do right now. Check it out. <laughs>